I'm NBC 10's Sheila Watko. Well, good morning, I'm First Alert Traffic Reporter Sheila Watko. I'm your host today, Sheila Watko, and I am thrilled to be here with you. Right now, they're stretching all the way back past 476, the blue route, and you can see all of this traffic is completely stopped. It looks like a parking lot out there, so many brake lights. So this is a four-lane highway right now, reduced down to just one lane getting by. That right lane is able to inch by, but you can see as Skyforce 10 is showing us big delays, and the northbound side is seeing really big delays as well. For today, the Norristown High Speed Line, the buses, the trolleys, the Market Frankfurt line, the Broad Street line, all actually running on a normal weekday schedule. For tomorrow, all five of those, they're going to be running on a Sunday schedule. But overall, snow is not sticking. Where it is sticking is in Delaware, a little further south. Here's the Dover area, Route 13, right around Scarborough Road. Look at that. So much snow on the roadways. But a lot of these vehicles start off going to that halfway through. They slow down a lot and realize just how deep it is. They're turning their hazards on. So I don't want you guys going through that. Let's talk about ways to get around that because it is potentially dangerous. If you want to avoid waiting in all this, this looks like about half an hour or so of delays worth. You want to stick to the Black Horse Pike instead to help you get around this. Oh my gosh, it goes back so far. All lanes remain closed and this is right around Spring Garden Street. Actually, wait, wait, wait. It looks like they may have just opened that left lane, which is also that on ramp. Let's go to, I think choppers on the scene, Skyforce 10. Yes. Okay. That left lane's finally getting by. Let's talk about alternates to help you get around the area. First of all, you can take route 291 or you can take route 13. Both of those are going to be backed up as well with other drivers doing the same thing, but at least you will be moving along. Take either of those down to route 452, use 452 to get back onto 95 South. Here's a look on our map. You can see how it's affecting us from three different directions, slowing us down really four different directions now because 295 South is also feeling those effects down the shore route 40 west of the AC Expressway all lanes closed due to flooding. We've also got reduced speed limits on the Garden State Parkway as well as the New Jersey Turnpike from the Delaware Memorial Bridge up through Mount Laurel down to just 35 miles per hour. We are having a messy morning out there on our SEPTA bus routes. You can see a ton of delays across the system. I'm such a nerd. I got so excited to see this because I love when we when we catch them clearing out the construction in the morning for all of my Jersey friends. Don't be salty, but I do have a twist in your morning commute. Right now we're taking a look at the westbound Ben Franklin Bridge. The foot of the bridge on the Philly side, this overturned tractor trailer. It looks like it's actually full of boxes of Annie Ann's pretzels. And Alexa, play pomp and circumstance. We've got grads in the house, Westchester University. Ceremonies all day tomorrow and Sunday, so expect extra delays on 322, 202, as well as Route 3. Fire up a good podcast, get a good playlist going, and just prepare for that <laughs> frustration and prepare to wait in those delays until you can get across that bridge. Keith, back to you. You. Good advice, especially on the podcast part two. <laughs> Sheila's got it all. I was pretty jealous of Bill's turkey. So in honor <laughs> of the best Thanksgiving movie, we're going to take a look at planes. Right now, if you're heading on 95 towards the this airport in either direction, everything's looking really clear. We'll take a look at trains, mass transit. Everything's running on or close to schedule right now. A great morning out there on SEPTA. And we'll wrap up with the talk about automobiles. 95 northbound after an earlier crash cleared approaching Bridge Street. Thank you. So I'm waiting for things to get treacherous out there on the roads with all this rain. But for now, 95 northbound in Delaware County. I knew you were trouble. The last time we checked, there was a little bit of a red patch on our map. Thanks, Steve. Fortunately, things are looking nice and swift out there. Oh. Are you ready for oh. it? A nice clean look at the Ben Franklin Bridge in both directions. Things are very delicate, so you want to keep your eyes open. There's not much daylight. You want to get to your destination safe and sound. I got nervous in the middle. I'm sweating, guys. I'm sweating more than Jake <laughs> Gyllenhaal this morning, I think, which is saying something with the release of this album. <laughs>